All right, so in this problem, we're asked to add three fractions together. Each fraction has a different denominator than the other. So in order to add them, we have to find the common denominator between them. Now I've listed all the multiples, or most of the multiples, of 4, 7, and 14. And I stopped once I realized that 28 is the common denominator between them. Now to get from 14 to 28, we multiplied by 7. To get from 7 to 28, we multiplied by 4. And to get from 14 to 28, we multiplied by 2. Okay, these numbers will be useful to us in just a moment. I will remove this so we'll have more room to work. All right, let's get started. We have one fourth that we want to turn into a common denominator, a, a denominator of 28. Now, in order to get from 4 to 28, we said that we multiply it by 7. Now, if we multiply the denominator by 7, we'll also have to multiply the numerator by 7, giving us 7 over 28. All right, the next one. 3 over 7, we want to turn into 28. Now, to get from 7 to 28, we multiply by 4, and we'll do the same for the numerator, giving us 12 over 28. Now, our last fraction, 1 14, we want to turn into have a common denominator of 28, so we multiply by 2. We multiply the denominator by 2, we multiply the numerator by 2, and that gives us 2 over 28. Now, we can add all of our fractions together. We have 7 over 28 plus 12 over 28 plus 2 over 28. Now when we add these, we just, we just have to multiply or add all of the numerators together to get 21. And we keep our common denominator of 28. Now this fraction is our final answer, but it's not in simplified version yet. So we have to find a number that divides evenly between to 21 and 28. So that number will be 7. If we divide 21 by 7, we get 3. And if we divide 28 by 7, we get 4. So 3 fourths is our final simplified answer.